guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to tell you about the kotlin so i am going to start a series of kotlin so that you can find full kotlin course on one place so the agenda of this video uh, this video is to just tell you about the what is kotlin history of kotlin and the features of the kotlin so what is Kotlin? Kotlin is a new programming language which is available in the market to develop Android application and you can develop any uh, kind of application. JetBrain developed software like Android Studio, IntelliJ, Idea, PyCharm, etc. So JetBrain is a company who developed this Kotlin as well. Target JVM, Android native and JavaScript. So the Kotlin's main target is the JVM, Android native and the javascript history of kotlin so this language kotlin announced by jetbrain in 2010 like they are starting development for it they made it open source so kotlin is an open source statically type programming language that target the jvm android javascript and native it is developed by jetbrain Version 1.0 was released live in 2016. So in 2016, the first version of the Kotlin was launched. Google I.O. 2017 Android first class support for the Kotlin. And in 2019, Kotlin is then Android's official language. So for Android, we can develop any application in the Kotlin. Features of Kotlin. Kotlin is the statically typed language means it check at the time of compile like if you declare a variable of integer then you cannot assign any string value to that. So that is actually checked at the time of compile. This is object oriented and functional language. So you know you can use that similar to the Java like uh, oops you follow the oops concept in java similar you can follow it in the kotlin as well this is 100 percent interoperable with java so you can write code in java and use it in the uh, kotlin and write the code code in kotlin and use it in the java as well because at the end both are building running uh, both are building the bytes code concise safe and powerful so kotlin is more concise rough estimates indicate that approximately you can cut off the 40 percent of number of line code so it is very safe and powerful as well it is as i mentioned it is open source so kotlin is an open source language you can contribute code is available on git so you can give your input if you want Guys, that's all for this video. In my next video, I'll show you how you can install Kotlin, how you can run Hello World. And if you haven't subscribed my channel, please subscribe, like, and share. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you.